Welcome Dragon Champions to another Dragon Log Gaming Presents Dragon Champions video. I am your host Dragon. Thank you so much for being here. If you are new around here, hit that subscribe button, hit that notifications bell, like the video if you like it, and drop a comment down below. But let's go ahead and talk about gladiators. Gladiators are super important to this game, uh, and the reason why they are super important is the gladiator duel. Um, as you can see, I have been able to one star this event, and it, you know you can get a lot of ability scrolls uh, by being able to do this event. So I thought I'd do a little something new and talk about what the importance of the gladiators and I think it's pretty self-evident that they're important because of the gladiator duel and getting the ability scrolls. Now, if we look at who are our gladiators, gladiators in this game are consisted of 10 characters. Those 10 characters are Ember, Little Batty, Revel, Mortha, Mar, Mega Wheel, Master Duo, Eric the Shieldbreaker, or Eric Shieldbreaker, and Diesel Rog and Bori. As you can see, this is my main account, uh, my personal account that I have here, and I have Little Batty and Ember, uh, Revel, Mortha, Mar, Mega Wheel Master Duo, Eric, uh, Shieldbreaker, and Diesel Rock Unlocked. But as you can see, I'm not really, I have enough shards to unlock Diesel Rock at seven stars, but I have not done so. Uh, and I do not have any shards of Bori. Um, if you've been following the channel around for a while, you, would, you remember that I did not enter the tournament for Bori because I forgot uh, to. And then with Eric, Eric Shieldbreaker and Diesel Rog, I just haven't had the need to level them up. Um, as you can see with Revel, he's just an amazing character. I did an in-depth character guide on him and Snorri. Uh, if you want to watch that, go ahead and click the uh, up the the icon in the upper right hand corner that'll be able to tell you uh you know about what i think about revel uh but mortha and mar you need to be able to unlock soleus master duo is really 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 good for the raid um first especially for the first tier of the soleus raid he's really really good for the bleed team having slow and terminator reduction and mega wheel a lot of people have mega wheel now unlocked so they could uh and leveled up so they could get general murdoch so Diesel Rog's not really some a part of the game yet. Not really, he's not really playing a viable role. Uh, hence, why I have not invested in him. And then Eric the Shieldbreaker, or as I like to call him, he's actually a pretty interesting character, especially with his ability, um, you know, rousing cry, you gain debuff immunity, which applies to the entire team and gives armor increase to uh, them as well. So he actually gives a good bit. Of, he just can shut down debuff heavy teams with debuff immunity. Community. And so that is really nice. I haven't really found a need to level him up, hence why I have not done so, uh, because the gladiators I do have. Now, as I had shown you guys before, I have the gladiator duel done at five or at one star. The who I actually did that with at the time was Revel. Uh, what is my leadership ability here? Revel, Mortha, uh, Master Duo, Ember and Mar were the characters that I did that with. Today, uh, I was doing a little bit of testing. I realized how good Little Batty is with the new Gladiator tag. She really helps this event. And I'm just gonna go in and show you my runs on this event um, and kind of show you what it's like to have uh, do the Gladiator duel at level 80. If you're, you're coming new to the game, um, you, would, uh, you would know. These are all certainly characters that you should be leveling up. You may not have Ember yet. Um, we're going to have a new video coming out on Ember uh, about trying to get her and that sort of stuff. Obviously, I have Revel here. There's not really a, really a call for him, but he's the only one with leadership, so I just throw him in there. But you can see that Little Batty, you know, as good as she is, and everybody knows that I think that she's probably the best tank in the game, um, she just makes this so much better. So this is the lineup that you're seeing here, all level 80s. Uh, seven star, like year 11 uh, characters, it's these six versus your six. And you'll see that she, you know, with her taunt ability will really just make things fairly straightforward and easy. Um, between having Ember and uh, Little Batty, this makes this pretty simple. Uh, we're going to go ahead and stun Mega Wheel here so he can't get his taunt off or do anything. Um, and then we're just going to go right after um, right after Mar. 
I don't really have a whole lot of damage that can be done on the team. Of course, my team is pretty pretty stacked, but you have to be. Uh, these guys are these guys are tough, and they can if they get off, you're gonna you're gonna find that it's going to be difficult. Uh, but I have been able to. I haven't three starred the event yet, um, and because I could I can pretty easily do that. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and hit make a wheel again. Look at that, he dodged me. I didn't want him to get his cheat death off. So, but as you can see, we're just kind of. We're just kind of plowing around, um, not really having any issue with getting people killed. Let's see if we can get the blind off. We did not. Um, there. So little baddie here is going to die. Nope, there we go. There we go. And so, oh, oh, there we go. I forgot about him. Oh, look at me. I forgot. And so we better, I forgot he shows up. Uh, let's go ahead and taunt. Here, let's stun. And this is what makes this is why Ember's so good because she has the ability to stun. And then once you stun, you can keep him pretty well stun locked um, for a while, uh, which is always really nice. And then with Little Batty with the turn meter reduction, that was really awesome as well. I forgot that more Doom came up at the end, but as you can see, I'm not having really any issues with him. Um, and there you go. So more doom can be a real, real pain in the butt, um, but you can get right on through him with that stun. That's why Ember was so good. She allowed me to keep stunning him uh, when I had a lower level character. Um, and so really, really, really good to have the gladiator duel. Um, you know, being able to do this, I mean, look, you're, you're getting 40, 60, and 70 shards three times. So, that, I mean, that's just, you know, 210 shards uh green uh green uh, scrolls and you know 12 120 um you know 120 uh where is it 180 sorry 180 blue, purple and 12 uh 120 purples uh, so, i mean it's just really really nice and as you can see i definitely need those i'm currently working on trying to get my goblins up and you know having all these ability scrolls will definitely help me get my goblins to where I want them so I can unlock General Murdoch and start using them. But as you can see, I'm starting to level them out and level them up as it goes for factions. All right, here's my human faction. It's pretty straightforward, all right? Um, as, as humans go, we're looking pretty good there. Um, if you look at the rest of my factions uh, on my main account here, my pandas, all right? It's looking pretty good on pandas as well. Um, and then we go over to elves All right this is this my elves really haven't changed since i unlocked um uh, unlocked ember uh you know and so i can tell you kind of the, the only one who's really changed is wonder lula but i didn't use wonder lula and so we're going to be talking about that as well uh and then if you're looking at my orcs of course they're they're where they need to be um you know for solius because i have seven star solius and then um, you know, my goblins, of course, and then my demons are where they need to be to be able to unlock. Um, of course, I don't have Slinger and Shadow unlocked yet because I just I want to buy their things. So that's really it uh, for the video. I just wanted to kind of give you guys an idea uh, if we're going to, you know, of what drag, what what uh, gladiators really to work on. If I if I if I'm a new player to the game, obviously more than Mar, you want to really have those. You want to be pushing for Solius. All right. Master Duo. He's actually quite a good character for a lot of areas in the game, mainly mainly for the raid. But of course, he can help you a ton with turn meter reduction um, on you know, on uh more doom uh he so he can kind of play some of the same roles and then ember you know ember's really really great i mean she was the one that really made it so i could do this um but now and then of course little baddie which you're going to get free to play uh eric schilberger once again i think he's he's an interesting human i'm not sure he's necessary but his that ability uh rousing cry is really really good uh and then you know mega wheel you kind of need him anyway for you need him for to be able to unlock General Murdoch. So that is where we're at um, with the gladiators. Uh, if you have any thoughts, uh, maybe Bori. Bori's a good, good character. She does good damage, but I currently don't have him. So I have done a good bit of testing with him. He's interesting. He's just not necessary. As you can see, if you're pushing along and you already have these other characters, you're not going to have Bori available because you're only going to really be able to get bory shards out of the tournaments shop or if they bring the tournament back around so 
that's kind of what we're looking at for Bori. If you have any questions, go ahead and hit me up um, on Discord. Go ahead and jump my links down in the description below. Uh, my, if you want to hear my thoughts on Revel, go ahead and do that too. Little Batty as well. Go ahead and click on the top right hand corner. I'll put the Little Batty video up as well. Um, and then, you know, Mega Wheel. This Mega Wheel will do well for this, but you don't necessarily you, you want to start leveling them if, until you get Little Batty. Uh, that's really, really important. And then, of course, Ember. So look on for the next video that I have coming up. The next video I will be talking about how to unlock Ember if you're if you're new uh, to to this game. I'll do a five star unlock, minimum unlock for five stars. And then talk about seven stars with the different characters that are available um, and that sort of thing. I know a lot of people are pushing for failure and trying to get Phalia up. And if you're looking at my elves right now, I have not unlocked her yet, but I do have 100 shards of her. Um, very good character. Should probably make the event much easier to do um, at, at seven stars. So... Once again, I really do appreciate everybody being here. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day uh, when you're watching this, and we'll see you next time when gaming and the law intersect.